Hi, I'm, I'm here with Dale Robin Goodman and Lorenzo Rafa. They're both from WNPG. And WNPG has a couple of events coming up this week and starting next week. And the first one we're going to talk about is the open mic. And Lorenzo, you're involved with that. Could you tell us a little bit about it? Sure. Um, that came about um, in December of 05. I think actually it was Christmas Eve. And um, uh, I was asked to host a show. Um, I, 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 don't ha I used to have a regular show years ago, um, mostly bankrupt and morally in debt. And now I just sort of sub and um, I do a commentary every week um, on Thursday mornings. Um, but someone had asked me to uh, host his show, and he usually has um, wonderful uh, guests on every week. And I asked him, uh, who do you have this week? And he says, nobody. So I figure I'd just throw the mic open. And um, I had a couple weeks to plan. I um, just put out the word, you know, if anybody wants to perform on the air, come on, come on in. And we had like five incredible guests. Um, we had a 15-year-old uh, who played the blues. Um, we had a guy who, uh, who sang uh, a uh, traditional Irish uh, Christmas carol. And um, just all sorts of do wonderful people. Do they all people. play the guitar, or do they have different instruments, <coughs> or some do anything a cappella? Uh, that gentleman did it a cappella. And uh, we have a lot of singer-songwriters um, over the time who's come in. Um, but we've had one woman um, who played um, the, I think it was glasses. She just kind of oh. banged a glass and sang a cappella. And that was very interesting. And, and does that happen running in your w WMPG studios? We've had it um, the first. We've done it. This will be our seventh time. And the first five times, we've had it in studio. and. Uh, last time was the first time we've done it, done it before an, uh, an audience at the uh, USM Student Center okay. at the Amphitheater. And so we're doing it again there. So oh, that, that one's this week on uh, October 8th? Yes. Okay, could you give people the particulars if they want to sure. be Sure, that'll be uh, October 8th from 3 to 5 at the Student Center in the Amphitheater where they usually have um, an art exhibit. And uh, basically, um, there's no signing up or anything. Just show up. Just show up. Yeah, um, between two thirty and uh, quarter of five. Yeah, if you show up at quarter of five, you're kind of pushing it. But and uh, we're not going to audition you. We're not going to judge you. We're going to put you in front of a mic and you Sounds perform. Sounds great. And a little yeah. dangerous, maybe, but fun. Yeah. <laughs> and it's not just for musicians. If you're a stand-up comic, if you're uh, someone who does spoken word. Come on down. Oh, it sounds great. Yeah. Now, the other thing that we got to talk about is the Begathon coming up. That's very yeah. important, w yeah, WMPG. Yeah, it is. Let me just add that we, we ask for acoustic instruments. Yes. And we don't have time or space for drums, for drum yeah. sets. So, yeah, but it's great. We had great talent last yeah. time. It was fabulous, just fabulous. If you want to bring your bongos, that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> but if you have an elaborate <laughs> drum kit, mm -hmm. yeah. well, you can't do it. Begathon is how we actually keep WMPG running. Yeah. Um, we do that twice a year, a one-week pledge drive. We call it Begathon because at WMPG we call things what they are, and we beg for a week, but we beg proudly um, because uh, community radio is important and to our community. Um, as you know, maybe your viewers know that all of our hosts are volunteers. Um, programs are simply volunteers who've been trained by us to do radio, and. Um, so our costs aren't great, but we do have to raise dough from our listenership, from the community, to keep us on the air. And that's what WMPG's Begathons are all about. And, uh, well, this one starts October 15th and goes right through to the 21st. And when this will be broadcasting, that's just next week, actually. That's right. It starts that's on right. a Thursday. That's right. And uh, we, we kick off with a very exciting um, event. We are celebrating the return to Portland of Emmy Lou Harris. Um, so we are doing a little, f some features on those Thursday morning shows about her music and we have some ticket giveaways, exciting and stuff. And during the so. week, you probably have other um, events that you do. We do. The, the, the hosts always plan something, either great giveaways or special guests. or uh, It's a fun time at WMPG, and it's a great time to be around the station. A lot of our listeners like to come in and deliver their donation, pick up their T-shirts, and um, 
Yeah, it's really fun. It's great fun. Yeah, and I know it it's always seems to be very highly successful. High energy, and yeah, and, yeah. and we and people are happy to give money, and it's tough times right now. However, people, if everybody gives a little bit, we're golden. Well, you know, it, I wish you a lot of luck. WMPG is a great community television station. I mean, radio station. We're the television station. Yeah, you're the television. Yeah. We're the radio. But it's great to have those two resources, radio and television, o available to the community, and I wish you a lot of luck. Thanks. Thanks Thank for coming you. in, and good luck with the open mic. Oh, thanks. Back to you, Beth.